we're doing a viewing party for the Sounders game away at Kansas. We have about, I'm not sure, maybe 100 fans with us here. And we did some autograph signing, myself and Michael Tete. Um, there's some kids playing soccer right there and they get to interact with us and then we're going to watch the game as a community and cheer the guys on to three points. So it's just all fun. They get to, it's my first real public appearance really with the fans. Kingdom Hope put this on really just to be integrated in the community and also to come together with the fans and support the team. I believe in using the platform I have to definitely give back to children especially and also to adults. Um, so through Kingdom Hope at the moment we do lots of little clinics around the different islands. We've been to Bremerton, we've been to Squim and we're going to Linwood and other places soon. And um, at the same time, the ultimate goal, I want to go back home after my career in London and build an academy. I want to build a, like a state-of-the-art facilities and have teenagers in there who want to be pro soccer players and help them to understand life, um, life coaching, and also to help them become better soccer players. So hopefully by then I have a thing or two to teach and we can help them get to the States and tryouts in Europe because so many of my friends back home have so much talent, but they never made it. And so this organization kind of is to be that bridge between talent and actually making it, helping people to do that. So the re has been week by week. Um, first it was, can we get you on crutches? We did that. Can we get you walking on two? We did that. Walking on one, we did that. Can we get walking without crutches? We did that. Can we get you jogging? We're doing that. And this last week, I've slowly started to touch the ball and did some juggling. Um, it felt strange, but it felt great. It was like the first time I touched the ball in a long time. And so if I'm back in September, October, November, or next year, March, or in 2015, I don't care. Like, I just want to be back. So I'm just happy to be up and running. There's so much more to life than just playing soccer. I realize that. So um, I love soccer. I can't wait to be back, but I can live, live a full life without soccer. If we're solid defensively, I'm confident we'll score one. Alvaro's been scoring goals, Montero's always there, Rosales is fantastic, Alonso can score. I think we'll get one or two. It's about keeping them out at the other end. But um, I'm going to say 2-1 Sounders. Words are powerful. I'm Ziggy Schmid. Hearing the words retard and retarded makes people with intellectual disabilities and those who love them feel like less valued members of humanity. That's why we're asking you to help spread the word to end the R word. Stop by the Special Olympics booth and soccer celebration to pledge your support. It's time to respect and value people with intellectual disabilities. Please join us in eliminating this offensive language in everyday speech. Thank you.